If you're a healthcare provider who sees patients who are dizzy and want to understand how to do the SMOT maneuver, this video is for you. So with the Simon technique, we're going to treat the right posterior canal. Now the setup will be very similar to the, well actually is the same as the sideline task. So the patient's sitting with their feet over the edge of the bed. Now to treat the right posterior canal, we're going to turn Luke's head 45 degrees to the left. And Luke will hold onto my forearms here with both hands. And then on three, we're going to lay Luke onto his right shoulder as quick as we can. All right. Uh, any questions with that, Luke? No. You may get dizzy, but keep your head turned to the left and uh, keep your eyes wide open. Okay, on three. One, two, three. And you can bring your feet up. Good, so you're nice and relaxed. So his head is turned 45 degrees over his left shoulder. We'll hold this for one to two minutes. And then once the one to two minutes is up, we'll have I'll hold on to Luke's head again. He can hold on my forearms. And then what we're going to do, Luke, is we're going to have you swing your feet over the edge of the bed. And then on three, we're going to sit you up and right over. We're going to right onto your, your left shoulder as quick as we can while we keep your head turned to the left. Any questions? Nope. Okay, on three. One, two, three. Up and over. Okay, and then we maintain this position for one to two minutes as well. Once one to two minutes is up, Luke, you can swing your feet over the edge of the bed, slowly return him back to the midline position. So again, that's the Samant technique for treating the right posterior canal.